So I had planned on making my next video about more number theory topics, but first I want to make a video. Um, originally I thought I would take some pictures of this plant, but I don't really think you can get a, <clears throat> a feeling for the, s the scale or the size of this, this uh, squash plant that I have growing here in just a still picture. So this is just one uh, example of a leaf and you can see it's maybe between five and ten times the size of my hand and they're really all like this and it's just continuing to grow um, maybe if I step back you can see how enormous this thing is so there's a few other plants mixed in there but also I go in under the leaves oh, just right here you can see all these blossoms coming up and down in there and over here it's spreading out and you can actually see uh, some kind of squash or zucchini growing off of it and I'm guessing the seeds came from a golden zucchini plant that I grew last year but I don't really know because this is a definitely a volunteer. I did not plant it. And if I go in here, you can see it's just, it's got squash coming out everywhere. Back there and down there, and they're all huge. They're not sort of fully formed, but even the small ones, even the young ones, are like an inch in diameter. And it just continues down here, all the way over here to where these uh, straw bales have been sort of destroyed. Some more squash down there, down here, and just more blossoms and it just keeps growing and growing yeah <clears throat> so that's just uh, one gigantic plant it's all one plant uh, maybe as an added bonus I've got a tick seed sunflower that's growing in here too if you can kind of see over here these flowers on this between these two poke plants is the tick seed sunflower and the bees really like this.